guys welcome to my home studio my name is Kelly and on my channel I like to share planner videos art videos crafts recipes DIYs mixed media happy meal and hauls and sometimes I will throw in a lifestyle video and if any of that sounds appealing to you I hope you do consider subscribing to my channel so without further ado I have a haul from endlesspens.com I've never ordered from them before so this is my first time and it went without a hitch so i'm happy about that and this is not part of the haul i've had this for a while uh, but i did get a gorgeous pen and it was on sale it's a sailor i've taken everything out of the package so let's see what it looks like shall we There you have it. It's very, very pretty, I think. So, this is it right here. It's very beautiful. And I'm going to read you a little blurb. This, because I find it interesting, the history and what pens are, in fact, and what their exact names are, and you know, the different design elements, I find that part interesting and I like to know about my pens. So there's that. All right, this is the Sailor, and par pardon my um, French, I'm going to pronunciate this as best can be. Sa it's the Sailor, and I'm going to read it. She ki ori. Sukuyo no Minamo fountain pen. Yozakura, which means evening cherry blossom. And I have the fine nib. So this is part of Sailor's Shikiori, which means four seasons line. This Yozakura pen is dedicated to the beauty of springtime in Japan. Its subtly sparkly pink finish is inspired by the sight of flowering cherry blossoms and thawing rivers on a cool spring evening. This pen's classic profile and medium size make it wonderfully versatile and comfortable to hold in any hand. Its fine steel nib is firm yet smooth, providing a pleasant and precise writing experience. Features spring inspired pink finish, gold colored accents, fine steel nib, two black cartridges, black ink cartridges, and a sailor gift box. So I think it's really pretty. And it does come with this about sailor, and it also has instructions if, in case you're not familiar with how to um, fill up your pen with fountain pen ink. Okay. So you actually keep it hooked up to this barrel and you just take the other part off and then you fill it up. Okay. So that's that. Okay. So let's take a nice look at this. It's a beautiful like dusty rose pink maybe blush a dusty blush and the top is like a very very faint off-white creamy color and both this part on the finial which is cream and this have a little slight shimmer to it as if the color was embedded with some sort of glitter so I like the clip. It's gold and it hooks the finial on with the clip. I like the gold here and this is a fine nib. You unscrew the cap you can post it. It stays on. It looks very pretty. It's for me 
compared to a lot of my other pens, this is very lightweight, but I really think the color is spectacular. I really like it. And I like that little gold accent there. And on the nib, this is a fine nib. And you just unscrew the barrel to fill it. And I'm glad they did provide a nice converter. If not, I have several of these. So you bring it up and then you twist it down just like that. Very simple. And on the inside it is silver. And then you can actually feel it when it goes in, this kind of converter. Just push it slightly and make sure it's secure. So to fill it, you just leave this part on and you go in just like that. Make sure it's up and then you turn it counterclockwise down, dip your pen inside your ink bottle of choice and then bring it up, turning it counterclockwise like I said. Okay, now I'm not going to fill this pen in this video, but I am going to show you and I am using my Diamine Shimmer in Magenta Flash. I think it's a very beautiful color. I really like it. And I just have some HP Premium 32 copy paper here at the ready. I'm just shaking up the ink to distribute all of that gorgeous shimmer, as it were. That sounds good. It's very pretty. So I'm just going to dip it in to show you. So that holds quite a bit of ink right off the bat. Beautiful. Quick brown fox jumps over the lazy sleeping dog. There's the smudge. So this is fine. And that's holding quite a bit of ink. And you can see how fine that line is. This is a beautiful color for this pen. I have a few pink options in ink. So. Beautiful. It is quite lightweight compared to a lot of my other pens, and it's holding this ink nicely. So, hello, beautiful. Okay, 
So that is that pen. I like it. It's a good pen if you're on the go and you don't want a lot of weight in your purse. And you can just slip it right in. Throw it right in your bag. It's a pretty fine point, I have to say. Some, it's not as fine as others, but it's a good width. So some pens that are fine are more fine than others. So. Okay, guys. So that is the sailor. She she ori sukuyono minamo fountain pen in fine. Yozakura Evening Cherry Blossom. I love it. It's a nice collect um, to add this to my collection, I think. So, that is a short and sweet video. If you liked what you saw, I hope you do consider subscribing to my channel. And I wish all you folks a very beautiful day. Peace out.